Wine production lowest in 62 years. What will that do to the price? Hello, this is Chart GPT today. You know, for all those that like a little red wine with their meals, uh, we have a little problem here. Uh, in the last 2023 here, it's 7% lower in terms of production. And it's the lowest uh, since 1961 in terms of the global wine production. However, at the same time, China has slowed since 2018. Uh, we've been seeing less consumption. Imports of wine have dropped. And yet the French government announced that it would allocate some 200 million to destroy surplus wine stocks due to the falling demand. So while we have the worst wine production, we also have some huge declines in people drinking wine. So it's kind of a, a tale of two cities, the best of times and worst of times. Here's the global wine production. It's been pretty flat and kind of downwards. Of course, now they're saying this goes to 2020. And so it'll actually continue further down here. If we go out, here's a, here's a kind of a, a longer term chart. And you can see here that global wine production is pretty much the same as it was in 2019. It's predicted to go higher here, so maybe they'll recover. But the point is, is that uh, even though with the bad production, and due to mostly because of what they claim is climate change, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, uh, it is expected to be quite a low. Here's a kind of a chart on where who produces wine. Italy is the biggest, France and Spain. So half of wine is produced in those three countries, and the rest you can see there. Uh, we look at the, the kind of the global wine production and consumption. Your consumption has dropped off. And continues to drop off and yet the production so there'll be some jiggle joggles even with all this going on with his low production you see here one of the they're having protests between Spain and France uh, Span Spanish are trying to dump their wine into France and France is trying to destroy wine to you know in kind of a competition war so it is kind of strange that this is happening so given all this we ask the AI is is, is drinking a little bit of wine each day good for you we always hear that, don't we? A, little, a glass of wine a day is supposed to be good for your health. We ask the AI, is that true or not? And we ask to take our online poll. Are, are you uh, going away from wine, drinking more wine or less? Give us your opinion on, on what your consumption levels are. And don't forget to subscribe.